So they're called ribbon microphones because they operate based on uh, what is literally a, a ribbon. This is a piece of typically aluminum, not always aluminum, but usually aluminum because you want it to be lightweight. Um, there are some microphones that instead of aluminum are metallized mylar, uh, but they're still ribbon microphones. And so, um, so this piece of material is extraordinarily lightweight and it vibrates very easily. So there's, there's no big spring or coil attached to it. Uh, this ribbon is free to vibrate and it's, it's floating or suspended in a magnetic field. And, um, and as that ribbon moves back and forth in the magnetic field, again, that creates uh, a voltage that we can read off as audio. Okay, um, now these have uh, very, very low output. So typically you have a step up transformer that operates at least in the range of one to 30 and sometimes one to 100, depending on other factors. So there's a hu huge amount of gain that, that, uh, uh, that follows a design like this. Um, but again, other characteristics follow as well. So um, they tend to have a figure of eight polar pattern. Does everyone know what that means? Figure of eight means that it, uh, they hear sound from both sides. So why is that? Well, it's hard to tell from this, but this is open on both ends, right? Sound hits it from the front, sound hits it from the back. And so that, that means it picks up sound in both directions. Um, more typical uh, microphones are unidirectional or cardioid, uh, which is to say they mostly hear sound coming from the front. Okay, but because this ribbon is suspended in space and open to both ends, it has a figure of eight polar pattern. Um, because that ribbon is so lightweight, ribbons tend to have a very accurate transient response. That means they respond very uh, quickly to changes in sound pressure. They tend to have significant proximity effect. So proximity effect means that when you get closer to the microphone, uh, it sounds bassier or boomier, all right? Um, figure eights, uh, the figure eight pattern is a, is a highly directional pattern, and it is just a characteristic of uh, directional, uh, of microphones that as the pattern becomes more directional, the proximity effect is increased. Okay, so figure eight microphones have more proximity effect than do cardioid microphones. Um, and so some ribbon microphones are described as having a, a proximity effect that starts a couple of feet away which means you could be this far away and it's, it's artificially basier than it normally would be. Um, so that's just a characteristic that you would watch for in the studio. Uh, because that ribbon is so lightweight, it's very susceptible to damage from wind blasts. So if you blow a puff of air at it, that piece of metal can just snap in two and then your microphone's dead. Uh, so you have to be very careful about that. Um, they take EQ well, they have low output, uh, usually they have low output if it's a, a passive ribbon microphone, meaning no circuit to do gain, uh, to, to do additional gain. They have low output and then uh, need uh, significant clean gains.